Schluter Quadec is a finishing and edge protection profile for outside corners of tiled surfaces. The reveal of the profile forms a square outer corner, providing a versatile alternative to ceramic trim. Quadec's wide range of materials and finishes allows for unlimited design opportunities. Choose your profile to match your tile or create a modern, contrasting accent depending on the look you want to achieve. In addition to finishing, Quadec also protects tile edges that are vulnerable to damage if left exposed. Quadec features several accessories to facilitate installation, including universal inside-outside corners and connectors. This versatility makes Quadec an ideal choice for virtually any tile application. From walls, to showers, to countertops, with Schluter Quadec, the options are endless. The first step towards a successful project is planning. In this example, we have selected the tile and corresponding profiles and determined the overall layout. Quadec will be used to finish the final course of wall tile and the outside wall corner. Quadec FS will be used as a feature strip profile within the tiled wall. The Schluter Dialex AHK cove-shaped profile will be used at the floor-to-wall transitions and the inside wall corner. We selected the Quadec size according to the thickness and format of the adjacent tile. In addition to tile setting tools, be sure to gather the appropriate cutting tools for the profiles. Depending on the profile materials, different tools will be required. For the Quadec in aluminum, we will be using a variable speed angle grinder with the Schluter ProCut TSM cutting wheel. Aluminum profiles can also be cut using a chop saw or miter saw with a non-ferrous blade. Another option for cutting aluminum profiles is to simply use a hacksaw. Look for a bimetal blade and select the highest teeth per inch or TPI available. A miter box is recommended to help ensure a straight cut. The planning is now complete and we're ready to prepare for installation. In this video, we'll demonstrate the proper installation of the Quadec profile and accessories in a wall application. The sequence may vary depending on the layout and installer preference. The Quadec profiles are installed in conjunction with the wall tiles. We check the walls with a straight edge to see if they are flat or will require any correction before the installation begins. This is an important consideration in any application, but especially when profiles will be used as shown here. The Dialex AHK profiles and some of the wall tiles have already been installed. Now we are ready to demonstrate the Quadec profile installation. We'll begin at the outside wall corner. The profile is cut so that it will end along the top of the last course of wall tile. To help ensure an accurate measurement, we've laid out the wall tiles on the floor with spacers. Measure along the tiles and transfer the measurement to the profile. The Quadec is cut using a variable speed angle grinder with the Schluter ProCut TSM cutting wheel. Be sure to observe all safety instructions and standards. Set the angle grinder to the lowest speed. Cut the profile slowly. Using the grinder on high speed or trying to make cuts too fast can result in warping and discoloration of the metal, particularly when cutting stainless steel. File the cut end of the profile to remove any burrs. Before installing the Quadec, we need to identify any areas where the profile's anchoring legs overlap. This must be avoided since it will interfere with the tile installation. Trim the anchoring leg where it will meet the Quadec FS feature strip and the Quadec profile to be installed above. Dry fit the profile before moving forward with the installation. Fill the end of the Quadec profile with thin set mortar and insert the corner to align with the shape of the profile. Using a notched trowel, 
Apply thinset mortar to the area where the quadec is to be installed. Press the anchoring leg of the profile into the thinset mortar and align. Trowel additional thinset mortar over the anchoring leg to ensure full coverage and support of the tile edges. Solidly embed the tiles so that the tiled surface is flush with the surface of the profile. Set the tile to the integrated joint spacer, which ensures a uniform grout joint. In the case of stainless steel quadec, leave a space of approximately 1 16th to 1 8th inch. Remove excess setting material from the profile immediately to avoid any damage to the finish. Continue setting the tile and the Quadec FS feature strip profile, stopping short of the last course of wall tile. Measure and cut a section of Quadec to fit between the inside and outside wall corners. Make sure to take into account and measure between the Quadec corner accessories as shown for proper fit. The anchoring leg is trimmed at the ends of the quadec to avoid overlap with the adjacent profiles, including the Dialex AHK at the inside wall corner. Fill the end of the quadec profile with thinset mortar and insert the corner. Install the profile and trowel additional thinset mortar over the anchoring leg. Install the last course of wall tile. Verify proper alignment of the profiles and tile, particularly at corners where profiles intersect. Apply thinset mortar in preparation to install the next section of quadec and final course of wall tile. Connectors are available and can be used to help align consecutive quadec profiles. Install the profile and trowel additional thinset mortar over the anchoring leg. Install a tile to help hold the profile in place during the next steps. Install the adjacent section of Quadec. Slide it over the connector and abut the previously installed section. Install the remaining wall tile flush with the adjacent profiles. Be sure to remove excess setting material from the profile surfaces to avoid discoloration or damage of the finish. The Quadec installation is now complete. With proper planning and execution, Quadec will provide a clean, modern finish for tile edges and outside corners in a range of tile applications.